one. Sky Creeper here, Aaron Phillips. Uh, so I was playing around um, and I found a way to make propellers that are believable. Well, not believable, but pixelated style propellers. Let, let me show you. It's very simple. And I was out to uh, make them. I'm just going to show you how to make one of them because, as you can see, you can run them in sequence with any uh, redstone circuit. If you want, I'll in the video. I'll show you how. To, I found this on YouTube. It's very, very uh, simple. So uh, yeah, let's see. You're going to need your desired brick. You're going to need, well, the redstone repeater is how you get the circuit there. Uh, you're going to need, let's see, your desired trapdoor. The trapdoors are what's going to look like the propeller, so whatever propeller. I'm using uh, the spruce trapdoors. Uh, they seem to look the best as propellers, but you can use whatever you want. And you're going to want a redstone torch. Let's see. And it, it, see, it's not that you know hard of supplies to get. It's not that many. Um, also, if you're doing this in uh, survival, I recommend. About that. This, of course, is all one box. Big frame. Let me show you how to build it. Let's see. Well, with there, from there, I'm going to pretend like, you know, this is the actual of it. block. I have staircases this one up. You can use whatever you want. I'm just going to break that. So that's two. Oh wait, never mind. I didn't mean to break that right just yet. You're going to want to put one here. That that one you could have made a dirt. So let me try to find That way you know, okay. So we're gonna, these are gonna break a couple blocks. What you're gonna wanna do, I'll even pretend like I'm in creative myself. Make sure that it's opening from that, you know, that way. Now I believe we can break this. I'm gonna put one there. One there. And then uh, your block there. Kind of like you did right here. Make sure that it's opening towards that side. Same thing on top. Then take your redstone torch, put it there. And I've seen a lot of people put buttons 
at the end of the nose to just make it look neat. That's pretty much all it takes to make an engine. That, that, that's all it is. And uh, let me find Let's pretend like this is the redstone circuit coming. Or better yet, let me do it like this. This is just how Hoppers. So let me see if I can't find those. Yeah, two hoppers. One, two. systems at all. Click. I should be going into that one. And then shift right click on that one. Oh, yeah. That needs to go there. That needs to go there. You can put the uh, switch pretty much next to it or on top of it. Take that and put it inside that. And that's pretty much because all it is is taking that redstone and switching it between the two. And you can make it start and stop with the switch. For doing it like this, I found out if you put the switch on the side that has these, on the one that has this, it'll be on when you turn it off, if that makes sense. And like, to make it stop, put it on this side, like when you're done. See what I mean? Like, it's cycling right now. So if you turn it off, the redstone will be on. But if you put it on this side, you know, it'll be off when it's cycling. Well, that 
up is uh, how you make, uh, um, like I said, you can connect them. I figured it was kind of easy, kind of neat. Thank you for watching. Like I said, I'm planning on building like a B-17 type plane at an airfield in survival mode. So that, that should be very interesting. But first I got to build an air for, uh, airfield. But uh, thank you for watching. Uh, have a great day. And uh, have a good one.